Who's ready to get your fill of risk? I'm Phil. I'm a top grandmaster playing risk global domination. On my channel, we talk strategy. So for tips, tricks, and techniques, subscribe and follow. This is Classic Fixed on my All Fixed account. I think I just saw it was 66 and 24. I don't know the rank. It was getting close to a thousand. And, um, but they did the rank reset. So, okay. I want to save my troops in Europe, and Black has this great play for Europe. So my first attack is 4v1 down, right? Um, and maybe add and create an army in Middle East at this point. Don't block me, though. Don't block me. I don't want those troops gone. Perfect. Um, and then my next attack would be add to the two, two be one down. And then this four, I think should be safe for a little while. And then these twos can fortify together at some point. Oh, wow. And then I'll just have a big army and I'll decide what to do later. Cause I don't really have like a great continent. So look, black has Europe. I don't have Australia. I don't have South America. Those are the big ones. Everybody wants. It's possible I can go for, um, Africa at some point, but I have like there's way more troops than what I have in North America. So right now I'm just trying to like stay alive. So Red is just making a big army over here. They might be doing the same thing as me, or they might be planning on coming down into Australia. You never know. I would have gone 4v1 and moved in. That's what I would have done. So I, th I think they probably want South America, but they don't know how to like properly conserve troops to get it. Okay, me and Black should be friends because I'm clearing out this for them. Then, like, I'm hoping that maybe they clear out of. Okay. Whoa. Hey, Snap Try Harding. What's up? Uncle Traveling Maddie, thanks for the raid. Party is six, coming in. This is my third classic fixed game of the night. And guess what, guys? I made top 65 playing classic fixed. <laughs> Or example, how come it always tells me you're a first time viewer? Every time you, you chat, I think it's broken. But no, really, I think I was, I think I probably with winning two tonight, I cracked the top 1000 playing classic fixed. I'm 66 and 24 playing classic fixed, but we'll never know because of the rank reset. And so we're just getting started on this game. This is our first turn. Um, so I didn't really have a good play for anything. Maybe Europe, but Black went before me and added there, and I allied with them so that hopefully I can get all these troops out. And I'm just going to make one big RB and make a decision later. Why? Why hit my two? Oh, because you want to move towards Australia. Okay. Whoa, a 5v5? What is going on? White doesn't know how to play. That's what's going on. White has no idea what's going on. Okay, so we'll see if Red or purple like cleans them up at some point in time um purple pink pink maddie you're streaming a lot these days how's that going for you and you stream at good times of the day too I have had days off or I've streamed on Saturdays and Sundays during the day. You can get some pretty good viewage from that, like um, during the day in, in the US, Canada time zones, you can get some pretty good viewage from that. We're cool, we know what's up. Yeah, yeah. Let's be friends, Sergeant Soda, I love Soda too. It's all good, Sergeant Soda. 
Yeah, it's all good. I think I gave him a heart. Happy Father's Day, man. How many kids do you have, Manny? I hope if they attack up with this four, they fortify back down. Man, people making crazy attacks. Yeah, portraits. Yep. Attack my territory if you need to. We're negotiating. I get Africa, you get Europe, we'll be best buddies, maybe I kill Orange at some point, it's all good. You know, like, I'm not interested in dying first in this game. Let's be homies. Three. Then you have a peach. Okay, so white has made crazy attacks and orange has made crazy attacks, which tells me we have two bad players in this game. Red is consolidating troops in a way that I like. I'm not sure about pink yet. And black is like negotiating with me so that they can have Europe and I can have Africa. If black decides to take Africa instead of Europe, I'll take Europe. Um, so we're all good. Six v two should win it. Three v one should win it. Life is hard, white. Life is hard. Somebody's going to smoke you, and you're going to get Australia and lose the game. Maybe Orange wants South America so bad that somebody just smokes you, like Orange. I know it's because of the rank we set, but I made the top 100 leaderboard stop trying for all of like five minutes. My moment in the sun. Orange Phil, it's all about them. About the orange oof, poor white. Yeah. Okay. So my next attack is a 4v1. Wait, so red added troops down here? Hmm. Don't like you, red. Don't like that you did that. White's four. I can't really get to it. But I'm pretty, pretty close to being able to kill good old white. Can it. Do it. Do it. Okay, so I'm not going to. I like staying in the Middle East with my big army at this point. I want to attack blacks one? No. So that's threatening. Orange looks killable soon, too. There's almost like an orange white kill on the board soon. So I think I'm going to go this way. And I'm going to give this guy some love. Tell him, attack my territory if you need to. I'm going to be friends with Orange until I kill him. Do you think white bots out? I don't like pink's game because, like, if you notice, we, Black and I have managed to get a big army. Red's kind of getting a big army. And pink's just, like, not really getting a big army. What are they gonna attack a three v one now?
Yeah, I think if, if if I can get orange to kill this four, then I just attack down and come over and kill white and take Australia. Um Kind of a weird split to get them both in one turn. And then pink and red aren't really worth it. Um, if, if they don't, then I, if this doesn't happen, right? They could still try to kill orange and take South America. Go boom, boom, boom. 17, 16, 15, 10. I'd have to add at least two to my three and then come through. And that's not that risky of a kill. What is red doing? Not quite. Oh, yes. Oh, right. I think if orange hits them, I think I take Australia and Hill. White. Red's preventing me from taking Africa. It's it's expensive. So I have a 20, I'd leave three. I have a 17, 16, nine. I should be able to kill white if, if this four is gone. Yes. yes. Attack white. I'm not attacking white without you attacking white. I think red's plotting to follow right behind me with their four cards. So then maybe I kill white and I plot myself on India. And I need to kill. And I don't guard Australia. That's an idea. I don't need the continent. I think red wants Africa. Let's see my trade. I have a wild, so I'm gonna have a good trade. Do I have a good trade without it? No. And I don't have any card, any extras. Let's make alliance with red. If they reply, okay, I'm feeling pretty good now. Here we go. I'll move my eight up. I try to get a take out of this three and move my eight up. I think I just negotiated with Red that they can have Africa and I can have Australia. Pink? Who knows what Pink's going to do? They could slam into my 13. They should not slam into South America. Oop. Do it. Sure. Yep, let's attack pink. You attack pink. I'll attack pink. We'll get him out of the game. 
Sure. Yeah, that sounds like a plan. Except for I'm not attacking pink. I want you to take Africa. Be the African. Do it. Boom, 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 boom. Yes, they look like they want Africa. Split armies is weird. Maybe they're waiting for their trade. I could add one here because I don't think anyone's going for North America to get the 100% roll. Usually I roll the 3v1. Okay. Oh, wow. Exalt, what's up? Oh, follow. Thank you. Okay. So the move here is stay alive, right? Move your army into like... <laughs> okay, so how do we beat black? I get into a three-player endgame with red and we make black the enemy? I think that's what we do. He wants me to attack pink. He's been a good ally. I don't really want to make him angry, though he is way on the other side of the board. Okay. Pink doesn't have cards. I had a big trade. Probably should have used it, but right now I appear weak, and I don't think anyone's going to kill me. Red could double tap me. If they do, they do. Thanks for saying hi, Exalt. Guys are funny. Orange and pink are like not long for this world. And then we're in a three player end game. I would not be surprised if that 13 fortifies down. Over there. Weird. Weird spot for it. Pink. Trades in. Take Africa, dude. Go just take Africa. Kill orange. He's killing orange. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. boom. Okay. I'm gonna wait for pink to get one more card, and then I'll probably kill pink. That was a bad route. Now you might not have it. That's going to be close. They don't have it then. Oh, they have it. Okay. I need them to have it because then they might throw the game in black. Well, that was very nice. Exalt, has, Exalt thanked me. The analyst... Analysis of the round three game of Pete, which he participated in. Salt's a good player. Red has five cards, but they're not really killable. Pink's killable, but then I don't trade. Um, 
Wait, does red have 33? There's so much over the board, though. So that makes this a 39 to kill 33. And having to punch through three, four, four more, make a split. No, that's not happening. So we'll do this. Let them eat pink. And then everything's pink. Black's not too much in the lead. Red's going to eat pink, maybe. Maybe, I don't know. I like, or I eat pink. Let's switch to North America. I don't know. We'll see. You're pink, you take a card and pass. I would not mess with red, who has five cards. My only fear in all this, red trades in, hits pink hard, black has a trade, is able to kill both of them, and then I just get second. I don't even know if I want to kill pink right now. They're, they're pretty, they have they're 26 troops for three cards and fix. I'm not thinking it's worth it anymore. She's strong now. Red trades, they have 47. Take Africa. You should have been taking Africa the whole time. Take Africa. Let pink have South America. We're all buddies. Yeah, move your four over. Oh, they're gonna move their ten down. Maybe North Africa for a while. That's not the move. Then Black's getting strong, just sitting in Europe while these two are going to war. Australia. So unless they slam into each other even more, and Black doesn't have the opportunity or misses the opportunity to kill them. Orange, you're not pink. Looking for that last stream, I was like, wait, you guys are who? What? Um, I don't have a good trade, but I have a trade. I have an army. Conceivably, if I could kill pink and red and break black at some point in time, I might be okay. I'd own like the whole board, and black would have these smaller armies. One more attack before I block myself from that side of the board. In trades. I made a major error leaving that 12. I would have tried to negotiate with Pink that you can have South America and I can have Africa. And then you can both get bigger for a while and try to catch up. Um, but I think moving this 12 in means you lose that 12, right? And then they probably break you because there's no recourse. Pink only has zero cards so like i would love to see if you're gonna do it you might as well if you're gonna hit them that hard like they could come down this war what do i do about this war oh, my light went out we can't see their ranks can we We can't see the ranks. Yeah. 
I'm not killing pink right now. They keep getting cards at the, at the wrong time. Okay, so I'm going to add two here to make that 100% roll. And then I'm probably going to move it down to Arkush. And then I'm going to start getting ones around here with this two. If black had this army unleashed, they could kill these guys. They could kill them and maybe... Mm, I have a big army. So that's maybe a bad move. I'm hoping at some point in time these two keep slamming into each other. Do I fear death? No. So I don't need to trade in my small trade. I can hope to get a bigger trade later. And lose one that time. Okay. Honestly, from this position, I don't do anything at the moment. But in the future, if it gets to where it all levels out, then we're offsetting black anyway. Yeah, the board's stabilized. So now I start adding two to this Quebec army, and I try to get as many ones as I can out of it without blocking myself. That's my goal. And then when I have to block myself, I'm going to block myself over here. Kamchatka, Japan, Mongolia, China. Well, not China, probably. But I think that that probably doesn't happen because I have so many ones around that people are eventually going to hit me. Dude, Red didn't give themselves a card. Thank you, Red. Red, you're my hero. Red, you're my hero. What is happening? Get another army. Get another army, Red. Balance isn't near broken. Like if I killed if I killed Red and Oh, then they buried the army so the black can hit them. Why? They just like attacking, maybe. Red likes attacking. Okay. Yeah, the eight. Cool. Not a big trade. All right, so I have 70. These guys don't have enough cards yet to make me happy. So, yeah, it's getting close to where, like, you can chain kills and win the game. Because if you take out, like, red, for example, then you have five cards. You, you're down, you're, you, I would be at 74, down, we'll say, 25. So I'd be at 50, plus 10 is 60. And then I kill pink, I would be... At like 25, 35, plus the attacker's advantage. It's almost to the point where I can like come through and kill them both. If, but it's not quite there. Interesting if red breaks black again. And then what black does if red breaks black. Because if black hits them too much... Also, I could kill Black, who I'm actually most afraid of. Okay. Only Calvary set. Is that all I have? 
Yeah. I only have 58 to take out 51. Since I have to hit two more, 50. Like I don't think I have it at this point. Let's just get a card and pass at this point. I like, no, I like where it was. No. There. You're versatile. Slightly. Get pink trades. Pink pink is getting trades. Ah. If I could have taken, if I thought black was like a hundred percent kill, I might have taken out black. Oh, they're going for North America too. Well, you tank has come cake. Not gonna lie, has some cake. What do you mean, take us some cake? Take us some cake. What does that mean? I don't think I had a trade at that point, though. Did I stop try hard? Try harding. Yeah, what do you mean by take? Tank has some cake. Now red has four cards. Black just nails them. Kill red. Okay. No pink? Yeah. So black doesn't have cards, but they have all these armies. We'll see. It'll be an interesting game. They have more armies than me. Four, four cards. I'm up on cards. Ooh, I have a bad trade. That's a bad move. I 
don't know what that means. Somebody had some cake. You're not a super fast attacker. So I just need to break all their continents. Do I use the trade? With your raw. Come down with that. And use this to clean up this. Or do I wait? I think I used I think I used the trade. I go this way. for my three to protect. There we go. So hopefully they don't have cards. I'm up on them. They have the card lead and they have two armies. Look at me. You hear what uh, the kill sound. Every trade is worth it. Don't forget such wide words. You can level up and risk now. LOL. Totally meaningless, I know. Hey, sixty-nine ninety-nine. You get twenty bolts. Hate the new kind of overlay. I hate it. All the things they could be fixing, and they keep adding stupid stuff like that. Okay, I have ten. Do I do twelve v five? How many? Yeah, I think I do. I don't know. It's like a trade, basically. Got you, dude. I think they got you. And they really want to keep breaking my ass dry. Let's see your cards. Let's see you come back from 13 to 41. Somebody tell me what tank has some cake means. I was a little worried about the not trading in on the last time. Nice. There we go. Three and zero tonight in classic fixed. Battle points earned. Sweet. Beginner, expert, novice, novice, intermediate. Okay, cool. We'll look at the rank, even though it doesn't mean anything because the rank reset. The funny thing is, I was at 65 a little while ago. New reward. New dice. I'm just going to equip everything. So cool. And it's because people are playing that I'm going down because I'm somewhere I was within like a hundred and some points of a thousand, I think. Oh, I'm at one three, so I'm probably in the top thousand, but we don't know. Thank you, thank you.